Okay, we're gonna cross bell biscay. This is our route. Okay, here we go. This is our water. This is our neighbor. Start the engine. Now I'm gonna pull the anchor and we're gonna get going for Bay of Biscay. On the doing, yeah, around two knots because of the uh, tides, but then they're gonna change after that. Then we're gonna get super fast tides behind us, so that's gonna be nice. And you can see the other boats, they're just standing still in the one place. Avionics marked like super wavy, I don't know what it's called, but we can already see the waves are breaking everywhere and they look all agitated. It's called the water turbulence area and we can really feel it. Yep, definitely turbulent seas. turbulent area the boat like went so much sideways that the whole side was underwater so that was that's still rocky as hell but it was quite fun I must say so the captain is seasick so he needs to take some pills seasickness pills Marta is in a great shape, right Marta? Yes. Good. So one of us still functions. So that's why we're gonna keep going. Good evening. Time is half past eight. I fed the fishes twice today because I'm so seasick. And I keep eating those dried bread stuff and salt pretzels. I can't eat, eat anything which results me being really cold and freezing. And I, whenever I sleep, lay down, I need to feed the fishes again. So 
so no sleep for me. So we saw the black fins, but now it seems like they're gone. Let's hope so. But I do want to see them too. Out there on the horizon. At least their fins really look like orca fins. So I hope they're the good guys and not the bad guys. Okay, so we're getting low on fuel. Not low, but we are around half. Uh, and the, now it's quite calm, so I just decided to fill it while it's calm, so I need that pump behind you. Yes. So with this, it's really easy to fill. Just put this in the canister, and this end goes into the bucket. Some hours, our sails are ready for the wind, and we now just gonna chill with the sunset. Nice. Sun is down. The time is 20:44. Oh, look at my dirty sails. That's not good. So the moon is coming out now. Look at it. Just like a big sun. It's a 
super nice. Good morning. Sun is coming up and it's eight o'clock. Good day. It's Sunday. Time is 12 o'clock. And we are still sailing. We sailed through the whole night. And the weather is getting really warm now. I took off my t-shirt to get some sun. Yeah, it's nice. We only got like 60, 65 miles left. So the night went quite well. Towards the morning there was, so we had to take down the mainsail. But now it's okay. But now again the wind is dying off. So let's see how it goes. How are we feeling? I just woke up. I'm tired. <laughs> so it is 20 past 6, and uh, as you can see on the map, we're approaching the shelf on the other side. We have just over 30 miles to go. The sea is really calm, just some uh, long waves. Um, so that'll be a good one. We'll arrive sometime tonight. Still no fishies. I think I'm gonna change the lure. So it's starting to get shallow again. We're well going from 4,600 to 2,700. Quite fast. We only got 30 miles left. with the um, fishing boys so, but hopefully it's gonna be like full moon night so it's not gonna be that difficult to see so we are now between 2,000 and a thousand meters deep and it keeps um, not rising but the other other way around and the sea is just so calm the sun is setting we Hello. are chilling yes and enjoying the nice evening i just got the message of welcome to España or welcome to spain so that's good all right spanish guest flag let's go going down somewhere there but because of the clouds we can't see anything so I hope we don't hit any fishing nets during the night so we need to have a look keep a look out and ho 
Well, we believe it's land. Kind of looks like clouds too, but we'll find out. But for now, we're saying land ho at 2053. Yes, there's uh, a light blinking on the horizon. Let's see, three, two, there we go. Okay, we are almost at the anchorage. Only thing we can see is the dim light of the houses and the full moon. So it's not that difficult to see for us actually. And after around that green light corner, that's where we're gonna anchor. We just cast anchor, but after we stop, we're starting hearing these like underwater fire sounds. I don't know if you can hear it. Exploring Spain for the first time. To the dinghy to shore where all the fishermen are. Then we're gonna drink some sangria and chill for the night.